keep it simple. A simple life is a beautiful life. Hello, welcome to Just Keep It Simple. It's been a while. Today I have some Dinterantis uh, Vanzeli here and I've just uh, removed the soil and you can see how long are the roots. I have another one even smaller in size but the root is equally as long as the matured uh, Vanzeli. So I'll put a few here. So mainly this is to guide you how tall of a pot you need because this is the potential growth of the uh, Vanzili root. You can see how long it is here. Let me try to measure it. Wow, let's say I go to the end here. It's about 5 cm long. That is how long the uh, Vanzili root can grow and this apply all to the other lip tops yeah to the other lip tops as well so how tall of a pot you need if the root itself is already five centimeter so do think about that when you choose the pot for your lip tops um, today uh, because I've uh, removed them from the soil I wanted to repot them so I decided to do this video number one is to show you the root number two is to show you how to trim the roots so I'm going to start with this one first so mainly you need to cut off all these fine roots yeah this is so long so I don't need that in actual fact I wanted new roots so I'm going to cut here okay I'm going to go with the other one as well so this is the main root so I've cut there too um, same goes for here and this one So I want new roots to grow from this plant. As you can see, here is the inner part of the root. So you can imagine a wound on your body and you need to let it heal. So therefore, you need to ensure that it has enough time to colors, meaning to let it dry, to heal before you plant into the soil otherwise uh, it will have uh, root rot as you plant them now for instance now I want to plant them in without letting them dry then it will cause root rot I'll show you another one here see the inner white part yeah so that's the part you need to add it colors on another note as usual do not water the plant immediately after you pot into your soil yeah wait for seven days wait for the plant to get used to the soil you provide them and then you water maybe after seven days a deep watering and subsequently a three days and a three days or a three days by observing the lip tops growth yeah currently this is wrinkled but not so bad for uh, professional planters they are not really worried at this wrinkle stage uh, but if you have time you see this wrinkle you want to water you can do so as well then they will plumb up so the three 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 rules three days watering stop three days and water again stop three days and water again is based on the soil yeah if your soil is uh dry after three days which it should dry uh, if not then you have to mix a better soil where it should dry after three days yeah soil that prolong after three days and still not dry uh, are not very suitable meaning the soil drainage is not good enough yeah it can be the grit that you use or the peat moss that you use uh, in the mixture of the soil so basically 70 percent uh, grit and 30 percent peat uh, would suit tropical countries now here 
as you can see the white root in the middle that's the part you want them to colors and heal so um, this concludes my video for today and uh, i'll check in with you guys again in my next youtube so have a good day ahead and for those Muslim friends and family who is uh, fasting this month, uh, Selamat berpuasa uh, and uh, have a good day. Uh, see you in my next YouTube. Bye-bye.